So I'm about to cook some fish. Christmas tree off of me. Not a Christmas tree. That's what this is. What? It's, it's a white Christmas tree. That's what this is. What do you mean? A white Christmas tree. I put up, you know, I tried. Oh, you put up a tree. Okay, okay, you, know, you mean, got gotcha. you. Yeah, that's a side hustle. I put up people trees and they pay me. Oh, okay. That's what's up. Mm -hmm. All right. I got some fish here, y'all, that I'm about to fry. And I have perch, sway, and catfish. Now, right now, I have it soaking in some lemon juice and water. That's my method of cleaning it. I'm going to go ahead and rinse it off with some water. I let it soak in the lemon juice probably for a good five minutes. It was soaking in the lemon juice. So here's a piece of the perch. Piece of perch. Let me bring the camera down so y'all can see. Oh, y'all like my head wrap? So the video I just dropped a little while ago, this is the same head wrap. But as y'all can see, I took the big bundle off. Which I should have done that, like I said in the last video. I should have took the bun off the top of my head before I showed y'all how to do the head wraps. But it is what it is. Anyway. All right. So, let's fry some fish, baby. Let's fry some fish. So, this is the perch. Before I season the fish, I always like to pat it dry. Get some of that excess water off of it. Okay, so like I said, I let it uh, soak inside of the um, vinegar, not vinegar, the lemon juice and water. It was probably soaking for a good five minutes, something like that. Now, I know I was wrong for taking that piece of fish that wet and putting it on that towel like that. Now, this one right here, I'm not sure if this is the, the sway or the catfish. But look, anywho, let's get some more paper towel. And this time I'm gonna squeeze out some of the excess water from the fish before I just put it on side this towel, like on this towel like that, because at this point, all I'm gonna be doing is wasting towels. Okay, can't be wasting paper towel now. Okay, that there. Let's get some of this excess water out. So how's everybody doing tonight? Hope y'all all doing good. I know I usually go live when I do my cooking videos, but I didn't feel like going live today. I was like, you know what? I need to get back into doing pre-recorded videos so I can edit them and, you know, stuff like that. So. Now that paper towel then got all soaking wet. You want to wash the car? Okay. What's wrong? You good? All right. Trevor, you eat perch? Yeah. Okay. There's just two more pieces left in the sink. I'm thinking if thinking about if I want to cut these pieces in half or not. I'm not sure. All right. And then this last piece. One more piece. Oh, you know what? I could tell now. 
can I? Y'all, I cannot tell which one of these pieces of fish is the freaking sway versus the um catfish. I'm gonna say this piece right here is the catfish. I think this is the catfish. I'm not sure. Y'all, I'm getting ready to make me a quick little drink. Get ready to make me a drink, honey. Yes. A little tequila. 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 So this is um Luna Zul tequila. Never heard of this one, but we're about to see what it tastes like. What it tastes like. We about to see exactly what it tastes like. One shot glass, one full shot glass. Pull that in there. Say ooh, ooh. And I got some ginger ale. I'm gonna do half a shot glass of ginger ale. Yeah. Let's see what that tastes like. Let's see what that. Let's see. Let's see what that tastes like. Give it a little shake. Mm-hmm. Mm. Isn't this glass cute? This is a cute little glass right here. Mm. Mm. Nice. Very, very smooth. Yes. Mm. Very, very smooth. Oh, yeah, that's good. All right, so back to the fish. So I am going to cut the fish. I'm still not sure if this piece is the sway or the catfish. <laughs> I don't know. Hold on, let me see. I think Charlotte. Ooh. I want to say, Charlotte. Yes. How many pieces of sway and how many pieces of catfish did you get? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Two of the what? Two of the catfish. Two of the catfish. Okay. Yeah. Yep. And four pieces of sway. Yes. Yep. Okay. These so. All right. Yep. So this is the catfish. And the catfish feels a little bit more slippery and like a silky, slimy feel. Not, I don't want to really use the word slimy. And the sway is a little more like textured and um, rough. All right? So that's how we can tell the difference. Now, once it's finished cooking... I don't know how we're going to be able to tell the difference because they look so much alike. They look so much alike. Oh, my God. All right. So, I'm going to cut this fish like so, like that. Like on a slant. And I'm gonna deep fry this fish. So they come out to be pieces like this. Pretty. 
All right, so I got all of the fish cut up. I'm not gonna cut the perch because it's already small. So we don't need to cut the perch up. Just the sway and the catfish, okay? And now I'm gonna season them. Oh, let me put some oil in the pan. I'm using a deep cast iron skillet. The cast iron, y'all, y'all know the cast iron. It just does something different to the food. So let's go ahead and put that on. This way, I don't have to stand here and watch over no fish. We're gonna let that oil heat up. And while that oil is heating up, I'm gonna get my spices out. We got some adobo, some garlic pepper, black pepper, some sea salt, and Old Bay. So these are the spices that I'm gonna use. So let's go ahead and season up our fish. Let's season up the fish, baby. Everybody say yum, yum. <laughs> say yum, yum, eat them up. Okay, here we go. All right, so I'm gonna use the adobo first. All I did was adobo the chicken. How was y'all day today? Today is Friday when I'm recording this video. You're gonna see this video tomorrow. So happy Saturday. Because today is Friday. It is Friday, TGIF, baby. I know y'all happy that it's the weekend. Yeah. That's some garlic powder. I'm gonna put a little black pepper. Just a little, well, not a little bit because y'all already know how I feel about black pepper on my light skin food. When I put black pepper on my light skin food, I wanna see it. I like to see the black pepper on my light skin food and fish is one of my light skin foods. Yes, fish is a light skin food, baby. Mm -hmm. I like to see the black pepper on my light skin food. On my light skin food. We're gonna do the sea salt. Not a lot of salt. That's it. And now some adobo. Not adobo. Old Bay. <laughs> I'm bug it out. I said adobo. This is a whole can of Old Bay in my hand. What am I talking about? Why y'all ain't correct me? You just let me say adobo like that and it's not even adobo. So we're gonna rub that in on both sides. Oh, I should have put some olive oil on it. Well, no, I guess not because it's going in. A, I'm frying it so it doesn't, excuse me, so I don't need to put no olive oil on it. Now let's flip it over. Flip it, baby. Flip, 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 flip. <laughs> Get another sip of this drink. Mm. Mm. Okay, so for the breading, I am using the seafood seasoned breading mix. 
It's by House Autry. I've never used this breading before. My friend Charlotte bought this. So this is gonna be my first time using it. And um, we're gonna see if it do what it's supposed to do for me. Okay, let's go ahead and test this oil. Okay, the oil is not ready yet. Let me let y'all see. It's not quite ready yet, see? Not quite ready yet. But this is all the fish seasoned up. The perch is seasoned. I seasoned the perch with the same spices that I seasoned everything else with. Yeah. So let's check it again. We ready. We are ready, baby. Let's get the first piece of fish. Let's get that first piece. Yeah. Dip it, baby. Dip it. Yes. Let's get that next. Ooh. Now, Tish, why are you splashing this damn seasoning breading all over the damn place? Why are you doing that? Ain't nothing like some good old deep fried fish. I am just splashing the bread and all over the place, y'all. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm splashing that bread all over the place. That's crazy. <laughs> I'm only going to put a few pieces in there at a time. I'm going to put one more. One more piece. One more piece. Then I'm going to let it do what it do. Okay, so let that cook, and bam, 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 bam. All right, let's take a gander. Let's take a look. Ooh, ooh. Everybody say yum, yum. Say yum, yum. Eat them up. Say yum, yum. So that fish is still frying, man. It's almost done. Actually, it's done now, but I want it to fry a little longer so it can be a little bit harder. I want it to have a nice little crispy feeling and crunch to it. Yeah, so we're gonna let it cook a little bit longer than it has been, than it has been cooking. Then I'm gonna take it out. So let me tell y'all exactly what I thought was going to happen has happened. I don't know which one is the sway and I don't know which one is the catfish. I don't know. They look the same. Hmm. That one is a little curled up. Let's see what this one look like. This might be the sway because it's not all curled up. Hmm. Let's see if four pieces curl up like these. If only four pieces curl up like this one, right? Then this is the catfish. And if eight pieces come out looking like that, then that's the sway. So we're about to see. We're going to see once they're all done. So I'm going to count the ones that's curled up. So we got one, two, three, four, five, curled up. No, this isn't quite curled up, so. I don't know. 
I don't know, y'all. Let's see how the rest of them cook. All right, so this second batch, y'all. I don't know. I'm starting to think that the pieces that's curled up is the sway because more of those pieces is curled up than anything. I don't know. This is what I was afraid of happening. Like, which is going to be which? Like, this is crazy. Mm, mm, mm. I think that's the catfish because that's not curled up. See? There's pieces that's all curled up. And then there's pieces that's not. Okay, y'all. So I figured it out. I figured it out. So these pieces right here that have all these lines on the back. You see all these lines that's on the back of the fish? These are the pieces of sway. This is the sway. And these pieces right here, this is the catfish. This is the catfish. It just has the back of it. It's just two parts. It's one little one and two. Right? You see it? One and two. The sway, this is the sway. That is the sway. I figured it out, y'all. I mean, I'd probably be like, well, girl, if you would have just separated them once you figured out what they were before you even started cooking them, you wouldn't even have to go through all of this. But you know what? It is what it is. Don't fucking judge me. <laughs> And they got my perch cooking right now, frying perch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, perch. Look at that perch doing what it's supposed to do. Ooh. Everybody say yum, yum. Ooh. Come on, perch. Yes. Take the piece of this catfish. This is the catfish. Ooh. Ooh. Let me give y'all the first piece. Y'all want the first piece? Mm, look at that. Ooh. Mm. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. That's delicious. So good. This is delicious. It's like seasoned to perfection. I don't even happen. I'm so telling the truth right now. Seasoned to perfection. And I'm sure the rest of them are. I ain't even got to do a taste test for y'all. On the rest of the fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank y'all for watching. Thumbs up this video. Subscribe to the channel. And hit the notification bell. So that you'll know when I upload another video. You definitely want to hit that notification bell. Because you never know when I might go live. When I might post a pre-recorded video. You just never know. So, go ahead and do your thing. Right now.